She is known as claimant ABC and is at the center of a legal challenge heard in federal court today. She spoke to CBC's The Fifth Estate in 2017. The woman is from El Salvador and says she fears if she and her daughters are sent back, they will be killed by gang members. But because of the 2004 Safe Third Country Agreement, Canadian asylum is out of reach. Since she landed in the U.S. first, that's where she has to make her claim. With Amnesty International and two other advocacy groups, she launched a legal challenge to the agreement in 2017 that's being heard in federal court this week. Outside, supporters calling for the agreement to be struck down. The main argument in the case, the U.S. is no longer safe for asylum seekers, especially under policies ushered in by the Trump administration. Often denied basic health care, denied basic nutrition, and often with their lives at risk. Children are separated from their parents. It's a moment of reckoning to decide whether we're prepared to stand with asylum seekers, refugees, and migrants, or are we going to continue to stand with and give a nod of complicity to Donald Trump? The Canadian government has been fighting to keep the agreement in place. In court submissions, it argued that the U.S. has a highly developed asylum system in place. Habiba Nasheen, CBC News, Toronto.